Hello and welcome Raider students and families. This is the 2019-2020 awards uh, ceremony. Um, we would much rather be doing this live with the students in the uh, wood gym um, in enjoying uh, this time together with you. However, uh, circumstances now are preventing it, so um, we still wanted to be able to recognize you for the um, performances that you uh, were able to um, do this year. And with that being said, we are going to begin by announcing the attendance awards. This year's attendance awards are only for semester one due to the COVID-19 uh, shutdown. We will only be representing awards for attendance in the first semester. First, we'll start with exemplary attendance. This means that um, students are here for every minute of every day. For the sixth grade, we have Anna Clampett, Ava Green, Logan Hammett, Alexander Harpo, Kevin Jones, Ava Markley, Raylan Marshall, Jakira Morris, Molly Ross, Carson Scheiber, Quinn Scheiber, Thomas Smith, Jacob Steele, Addison Strine, and Sarah Turner. And for the seventh grade, we have Brooke Beeks, Annika Carpenter, Landon Green, Braden Harris, Emma Johnson, James Johnson, David Kendall, Kaylee Krumenaker, mm, Layla Nagomi, Allison Royce, Marcus Richeson, Luke Runyon, Sullivan Stahl, and Marissa Trout. Exemplary eighth grade attendance goes to Blake Anson, Braden Bell, Atea Beard, Kelsey Cheney, Jay Clampett, Andrew Kreider, Kylie Fenton, Cameron Horn, Jamie Husband, Kylie Nall, Keegan Price, Jace Roby, Jasmine Roby, Hannah Surface, Vincent Tomei, and Calvin Turner. Semester one perfect attendance and which means that students were attending in school but may have missed uh, some periods for an appointment. In the sixth grade, it's Lily Ballinger, Peyton Berryman, Anna Clampett, Owen Cole, Kendra Frame, Isabella Guerreri, Ava Green, Maggie Hall, Logan Hammett, Alexander Harpole, Carly Horn, Kevin Jones, Nolan Jones, Adeline Lewis, Ava Markley, Raylynn Marshall, Scotty Middall, Jakira Morris, John Napier, Eli Ramp, Miranda Rieger, Molly Ross, Carson Scheiber, Quinn Scheiber, Thomas Smith, Kale Spar, Jacob Steele, Addison Strine, and Sarah Turner. For the seventh grade, Brooke Beeks, Tatum Brooks, Annika Carpenter, Chloe Couch, Anthony Decker, Brock Drown, Javin Gray, Landon Green, Jersey Hacker, Braden Harris, Luke Hill, William Holzinger, Emma Johnson, James Johnson, Aiden Justice, David Kendall, David Kendall, Kaylee Krumenmaker, Charles Myers, Michaela Myers, Ella Newton, Layla Nagomi, Madison Rakowski, Allison Royst, Logan Richeson, Marcus Richeson, Luke Runyon, Charlie Rupert, Sullivan Stahl, Garrett Stoffel, Jacelyn Sunderman, Brody Swainer, Marcus, uh, Marissa Trout, Autumn Turner, Malia Warpup, and Griffin Zom. And for eighth grade, Blake Anson, Braden Ball, Atea Beard, Aiden Beaver, Zachary Bishop, Xavier Carl, Kelsey Cheney, Asher Chipchoski, Jay Clampett, Andrew Kreider, Sable Davenrider, Cameron Dennis, Kaysen Dennis, Kylie Fenton, Daphne Gallegos Bosanegra, Cameron Horn, Delaney Hauser, Jamie Husband, Dylan Jail, John Johnson, Riley Motts, Taylor Mooberry, Kylie Nall, Ava Paulson, Keegan Price, Jace Roby, Jasmine Roby, Madeline Sink, J.C. Smith, Julia Spittler, 
Hannah Surface, Vincent Tomey, Calvin Turner, and Jose Luis Zavaleta. Lastly, we'll be representing three-year perfect attendance. Xavier Carl, Andrew Kreider, Kylie Nall, and Calvin Turner. Congratulations to all of the Attendance Award winners. Hey Raiders, I know you're uh, enjoying the award show. Uh, don't miss out on your chance to buy a yearbook. Uh, they're $27 right now. Um, sale ends May 28th. You won't want to miss out on the memories. Up next, we'll be announcing the awards for the sixth grade. First, we'll represent the AR top three. The following three students each um, on each team earned the most accelerated reader points during the first, second, and third nine weeks. They have been avid readers outside the classroom and are working towards becoming lifelong readers. For the blue team, our first is Maggie Hall with 338.6 points, Lindsay Diggetts with 338.4, and Mara Rieger with 314.1. For the gold team, we have Kale Spar at 347.5, Molly Ross with 271.6, and Isabella Mall with 243.8. And next we are going to honor the um, Alex Completion Top 3 Award winners for the blue team. Uh, these students not only completed all of their Alex Pie, but in addition completed 75% of their second pie. That's a lot. First is Lindsay Deggetts. Second is e Anna Clampett. And third is Eli Ramp. And for the gold team, each of these students completed over 150 topics beyond the required 10 per week. Uh, they put in many extra hours, as you can tell, to improve and enrich their overall math knowledge. Those students are Blake Stuckey, Quinn Scheiber, and Emily Perdue. Next, we will uh, we'll announce the science top two. The following students have earned the science award this academic year. The award is given to the top two students on each team for their curiosity and attention to scientific detail on science-based concepts. For the blue team, we have Rayleigh Pearson and Addison Strine. For the gold team, we have Lucy Smith and Emma Working. And now we are going to announce the Perseverance Award winners. Perseverance is defined as doing something despite difficulty, simply not giving up. The following two students have used perseverance not only in the classroom, but also during our extended remote learning. They have shown up and worked hard. For the blue team, Jesslyn Klopfenstein and the gold team, Zoe Asher. Next, we'll announce the overall top two for academic and citizenship. This award is given to the overall top two students in each team. The academic and citizenship award is given to the student who has not only exceeded academically in the classroom and during remote learning, but is also an outstanding example of being a kind and courteous citizen, both inside and outside of the classroom. They continually strive to be better each day. For the blue team, Lindsay Diggetts and Dalton Steffen. For the gold team, Jakira Morris and Quinn Scheiber. Hey Raiders, make sure to check out the Riverview Virtual Talent Show. You can find a link on our webpage or social media. And now we are moving on to the seventh grade award winners. And we're gonna start out with science. And in Ms. Giordano's uh, science class, the award winners are Evan Garrison and Malia Warpup. Both always contributed thoughtfully to discussion attended science club, and had stellar attitudes in class. And Mr. Hoffman's science award winner is McKenna Landrum. Uh, she had excellent scores on different uh, learning objectives, a very positive attitude, and works very well with others, especially in groups. Next, we'll announce the math awards for the seventh grade. First, we have Jason Sunderman in Mr. Lanza's class. Jason had the best overall grade in the seventh grade for Mr. Lanza. Ben Green is the most improved NWEA score. For Mrs. Knox, we have McKenna Landrum and Annika Carpenter. Both of these girls emerged as leaders within their class. 
They always participated in class, completed assignments to high standards, and worked through Alex meticulously. They maintained the highest grades within the class. Additionally, McKenna finished her Alex Pie. Emma Johnson also uh, finished her Alex Pie last semester. She's a hard worker and self-motivated. Additionally, she earned high grades on homework and tests. And now for social studies. In Mr. Rodenbeck's uh, social studies class, the award winners are Javin Gray and Marissa Trout. Both of these students have outdone themselves in social studies this year. They are very dedicated, hard workers who put forth their best effort in anything that is done in class. Javin and Marissa are very respectful towards their teacher and other classmates, participating regularly in discussions and always uh, get their work turned in on time. They ask questions that show they are interested in bettering themselves. It also helps that they always come to class with a smile and know how to take ribbing, probably because of their other siblings. And in Miss Meyer's uh, social studies class, she has a social butterfly winner, and that is Annika Carpenter. She has a great positive uh, attitude, always overachieving, and fantastic personality in class. A's all four quarters. For English, in Mrs. Dueling's class, Emma Johnson and Holland Updike. Holland and Emma stand out in part because of their thorough and well-thought written responses. Those types of answers do not happen, happen without some effort. In Mrs. King's class, Jacelyn Sunderman and Javin Gray. Both consistently have quality work, outstanding classroom leadership, and a positive attitude. Jacelyn and Javin are excellent role models for their peers. Honorable mention nominees, these are students in this category that have excelled academically and are being recognized as runner-up nominations by their teachers. Hayden Bailey, Jackson Barlow, Caitlin Bryant, Seth Gilbert, Jillian Haskett, Hannah Hopper, Luke Hill, Emma Hoey, Marcus Linker, Serenity Mitchum, Bray Braylon Pelfrey, Gwyn Penrod, Logan Richeson, Luke Runyon, Charlie Rupert, Anna Spittler, and Maya Wolf. And now we are moving to the eighth grade award winners. And beginning with science, once again, uh, Ms. Giordano's eighth grade science award winner is Aaliyah Stevens. She is, uh, shows genuine interest in science, went above and beyond, always looked for extra credit to pursue more knowledge and has a positive attitude. And Miss, Mrs. Jacobs' science award winner is Kelsey Ludeman. Kelsey enjoyed science class. She spent extra time learning the subject and had a fantastic attitude. She also helped other students whenever she could with a big smile and showed great patience. Next, we have the uh, eighth grade English language arts awards. First, we have Mrs. King, who had Johan Johanna Bragg. Johanna had exceptional work ethic and leadership combined with strong ability, which means every assignment is completed thoroughly and to the very highest of standards. Johanna is an example for her peers through her effort, attitude, and delightful personality. Mr. Wright's English class, the most outstanding English student was Kinley Landrum. She had excellence in all facets of the class, her reading ability, classroom interaction, grammar, and strong writing skills. Mr. Wright also pointed out um, which one of his students had the greatest sense of humor and is uh, well-deserved, Jay Clampett, for his innate ability to liven up a classroom with his high-level humor. And now for the social studies winners. In Mr. Andrews' social studies class, once again, Aaliyah Stevens, Tessa Mall, and Kenley Landrum all had straight A's each quarter, no missing work, and completed all extra credit with great attitudes. And Mrs. Meyer's social study winner is J.C. Smith, all A's each quarter, no missing work, great attitude, and she pushed herself to be successful in class. 
Next, we'll announce the eighth grade math awards. Mr. Abbott's math award goes to Johanna Bragg. She made maintained a level of excellence in algebra all year and always handled the daily challenges with preparation. Also, Kylie Nall with excellence in work ethic and she always engaged in, in learning the material. Audrey Rank was very prepared and diligent in her work every day. Congratulations to you three. Mrs. Knox's math award goes to Renee Grieving. She worked hard day in and day out she completed all of her homework daily. She excelled in assessments and always worked hard to find correct answers. Secondly, Kira Bear, she was the most improved. She has demonstrated tremendous growth over the last two years. She's grown in confidence, asked great questions, and has developed a mental toughness and grittiness towards completing challenging material. And now for the presidential Award for Academic Excellence. The Gold Award winners are Johanna Bragg, Asher Chipchoski, Reagan Cornett, Aiden DeWeese, Jane Gadd, Ella Hall, Josie Mobley, Keegan Price, Jessica Rice, Haven Rieger, Aaliyah Stevens, and Brooke Wall. And now the Civil Silver Award for the Pre Presidential Award of Excellence in Achievement is Kylie Berryman, Maggie Eaton, Kylie Fenton, Carmen Horn, Kenley Landrum, Kelsey Ludeman, Ethan Meyer, Allison Poff, Ava Paulson, Caleb Royce, Jasmine Roby, Luke Toysh, and Sophia Tolan. Next we'll be announcing the Related Arts Awards for this school year. The most outstanding female and male choir students are selected by their peers and Mrs. Webb for leadership cooperation and participation in and outside of the classroom. Those students are Carly Maddox, Madison Messner, Gabriella Martinez, Alexander Harpole, Luke Runyon, and Jay Clampett. The most outstanding Riverview singer, soloist in the competition show was McKenna Landrum and Sierra Tolan. Riverview Sing and Dance Captain Award goes to Aiden Beaver for outstanding leadership in the 2019-2020 cast. The most outstanding 7th and 8th grade dancers for 2019 to 2020 cast go to, goes to Kinsey Cobbs, Kel, Kelsey Cheney, and Johanna Bragg. And for the band members, the outstanding band students are Kiara Boothman, Malachi Working, Clayton Bell, JL Stevenson, Gracie Zartman, and Ella Hall. Next, we'll announce the awards for our TV. First is the most outstanding effort and performance in our TV. That goes to Hannah Hopper, Marissa Trout, Gracie Fields, and Carmen Horn. And for computer apps, the outstanding effort and performance in computer apps uh, winners are Isaac Wilson, Tessa Shell, Braylon Pelfrey, Julian Haskett. And that was for Mr. Husband's class. In Mrs. Landrum's class, the outstanding uh, performance winners are Samantha Atkinson, Kylie Fenton, um, Heaven, Heaven Asher, Jaden Stecker, J.C. Smith, and Delaney Hauser. Next, we'll announce the awards for the most outstanding PE students. This is for always giving great effort, never giving up, having a positive attitude, and being a great teammate and role model for the rest of their classmates. Mrs. Kyle would like to announce Rayleigh Pearson, Kata Newman, Elise Finley, and Anna Clampett. For that same award for Mr. Otis's class, we would like to announce Garrett Poehler, Tony Decker, and Caleb Royst. And for Tech Ed, uh, the Outstanding Tech Ed Award goes to Liam Sell, Luke Hill, and Kenley Landrum. Next, we'll announce art awards. This year's most outstanding artists are Garrett Puller, Ava Markley, Jasmine Donaldson, Julian Haskett, Logan Idle, and Haven Rieger. And for Read 180, the outstanding students are Carly Toysh, Jose Zavaleta, Beyonce Zavaleta, Izzy Lees, and Blake Stuckey. Next, we'll announce the Spanish Awards for the most outstanding achievement in Spanish. Those students are Jessica Rice, Jasmine Roby, Kinley Landrum, 
Kelsey Ludeman, Luke Toysh, Keegan Price. Well, that concludes the announcement of our award winners here at Riverview uh, for the 2019-2020 year. Um, as you can tell, we had several students recognized uh, for their achievement throughout this year. Um, our wish was that we would have been able to have an entire year here with the students just to be able to see them finish out uh, this year uh, while within this building. Those uh, choices were not left up to us and so we are pleased to recognize each and every one of these students along with those that uh, didn't necessarily earn an award uh, through this uh, through the the awards program but um, we are proud of each and every one of the Raider students that were here uh, this year and look forward to um, the 2020-21 year uh, with our new group of incoming sixth graders as well as the seventh and eighth graders. Eighth graders uh, we wish you the very best in next year out at Huntington North High School. Uh, make us proud and uh, shine bright while you are there. Thank you very much for watching and uh, have a great summer. Great job Raiders. Have a good summer. <laughs>